Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Uh, welcome to my um, prep lecture uh, regarding the dose calculation of different drugs. So today we will discuss about that. Let's suppose a, a person who is 28 years old, female, 50 kg, and she is admitted with post maturity in a hospital. It is decided to induce the labor. All the contraindications they are ruled out. Set in IV infusion of oxytocin for her. While the rate of infusion is 4 milli unit per minute. How we can calculate it? So first of all you will have to write down the weight of the patient. That is 50 kg. And her age is 28 years, uh, rate is 4 milli unit per minute. So, this is equation first. As we know better, the impule contains 5 IU per ml. So, it means that uh, the total number of milli units per ml that is 5 thousands. How we can calculate it? So, maybe mean 1000 should become. 5000 milli units per ml. After that, I'm going to add 5000 milli units 1 ml oxytocin and 500 ml of normal saline. And simple words, you can say that 5000 milli units 1 ml oxytocin dilute and 500 ml of normal saline so when 4 milli unit 4 milli units will be equal to how much ml so this is very simple calculation so in order to solve this problems the uh, cross we will cross multiply for this 500 ml of normal saline multiplied by 4 and this will be uh, divided by 5000 so it becomes 0 0.4 ml so it means 4 milli units is equal to how much ml 0 0.4 ml how much ml 0 0.4 ml now the question was that that the IV infusion of oxytocin as the rate of infusion was already 4 milli units per minute which, which is already given in a question so this was the result so it mean if it is calculated so zero point as we know that one ml is equal to 20 drops so it means that 0 0.4 ml is equal to 8 drops per minute so it means this is very simple and easy that for that patient whose age is 50 kg sorry 28 years and weight is 50 kg so this is very easy to understand and she is already admitted with post maturity in hospitals after that we are going to decide to uh, how to uh, induce the labor and all the contraindicated they are ruled out set in IV infusion apoxytocin for her so the rate of infusion 4 milli units per ml so this is very easy to uh, try to practice it and uh, inshallah then I will my next lecture will be about now look at here uh, this is uh, uh, look at here so how we can uh, these are the infusions look at uh, this is called air vented uh, drip chamber this is solution filter and this is spike this is tube this is roller clamp and this is needle this is connector and this is injection site so as usually we are using different type of infusions so this is the uh, label diagram you can check it so you can memorize the name of each and every part this is first one is spike this is air vented drip chamber solution filter and it's called tube and it's called roller clamp and this is needle connector and injection site inshallah in my next lectures uh, i will discuss about that uh, uh, what are the drugs